Hey guys, I'm, I'm trying to get the A count. Uh, to get it, all you do is get a really weak weapon, go up and attack one of these guys. I use my bow and uh, short arrows, and just let them grab you. Just keep your shield up and let them grab you, and the the wee worm will come out underneath the head. And just do that there a couple of times. Just keep your health up, drink a flask, and uh, when it sticks, your, your guys are doing what my guys doing right now. As you can see, scratching his head. There he goes again. And it can take up to 10 minutes for this egg to hatch, and when it does, uh, you join the Chaos Servant uh, Convent. And after you join that, if we talk to Eggy, the guy that I told you not to attack in the last video, um, he will give you um, access to spells to re uh, remove it, as far as I remember. But um, yeah, that's how that's done. But be wary of the egg on your head as well, because it can cause some. Um, bad side effects. I just can't remember what the side effects are, but hopefully I'll get back to you soon on that. Thank you very much. There we go. My egg is hatched, as you can see. Um, the effect of this here is um, with this is on you, um, you won't get as many souls from mobs when you're uh, fighting them. But now we're going to go up here back to Chaos Servant and I join them to get our spell. I, I can't remember if you have to join them or not, but Eggy that we did there will give you the spells. Well, now, you're just like me. Your dedication is fully apparent. Only, well, your head looks awful. Why not try this? I've no use for it any longer. He also will give you that. Oh, hello. What is it that you need? That will remove it. As you can see. Poison mist and poison and poison mist and toxic mist are the two spells that he will sell you. Because you have the egg on your head. And we'll just buy loads of these. And that's it. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Take care. Hey guys, now I'm back up here. Um, this guy should be in here. Should be awake now. If we want to talk to him. If I just show you this. Ah, hello. Was it you who rang the bell of awakening? I am the primordial serpent, King Seeker Frant, close friend of the great Lord Gwyn. Chosen undead, who has rung the bell of awakening, I wish to elucidate your fate. Do you seek such enlightenment? Very well, then I am pleased to share. Chosen undead, your fate is to succeed the great Lord Gwyn, so that you may link the fire, cast away the dark, and undo the curse of the undead. To this end, you must visit Anor Londo and acquire the Lord Vessel. And that's where we'll pretty much be heading next, but first we have to head through Sand Fortress. Um, he should also... He should also I am pleased to see you well. Is it something urgent? There we go. You can feed him items and shards and stuff. If you feed him shards, he'll break it down into smaller shards. Um, if you feed him items, he will eat the... Like, if you got, like, this... I'll show you this now. Um, since we have... Since we have a couple of short shards here, if I feed him it, I should get uh, 50 souls back. As you can see. The souls are going up. You only really need to keep one of each weapon, so if you have anything, uh, more than one, just let him eat them. And while I do this here, I'm going to stop recording, and I'll show you in a minute where, uh, where the guy is to get the master key now. So see you in a bit. No, 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 done that. I'm going to show you how to get the master key.
As you can see, he's sitting right over there. I'm not sure we need to kill this dude. And then we just run. And jump. Hi, Shamai. I didn't expect to meet anybody here. I suppose great minds think alike, eh? <laughs> And he now says you the master key. I'm pretty much still the same items as before. So that's it for this. Well, that is a shame then. But no matter. No, not to worry. Come back again. I'm always available. Not every trade was meant to be. There'll be more in store for us. Someday. Sometime. And that's it for now. I'll see you next time in the next video. Take care. Hey guys, uh, for a trillions this here battle I got summoned for it anyway. I'm not doing this yet myself. Um as far as I know there is no custom for this battle. Uh magic shield is a well not really a moss but a bit of a real great advantage. And I don't know what way these guys are gonna do but usually if you're still in the city you sit up here and just range it. I'm just gonna say I'm using different weapons, you know now you get my bow out. Pretty easy fight. That's probably the easiest fight in the game, in fact. Just keep raging her until. Oh, that's me there. You want to watch out for it? If you're, if you're summoned for this fight, like, it, you won't have to worry much about the magic shield then. And uh, she comes down. And you just really mess her up the gas, as you can see. <laughs> and she will give you the key to um, a shortcut. And as well as a uh, amber, which is unlock that door over there. Um, the key to the shortcut is behind a heavy rock. If that's what his name is. It's the guy with the big uh, hammer that one hit at me in the circle back in video one or two. Um, video one, it was. Um, door behind him not open that but if you, you don't have to open that door with that key if you have the master key that you can open it as well but that's how that fight's done guys congrats to if you're not going to try it it's pretty easy, easy. you see this fight in the game if if not <laughs> i don't know what is then um but yeah take care guys let's go back and talk to the forest hunt forest uh hunter captain and let's see if she's going to talk about shiva or chef or Seth. Yeah. Perchance, hast thou met Shiva? A lad cometh from the far east, strong of arm, now a clan leader of ours. And yet, still I feel that boy hides something, of that I am certain. Small fear that he will use us badly, yet on guard we must stay. And that man that clingeth to Shiva like some shadow, ensure thou dost treat him with the same caution. And um, well, that there's that pretty much. Let's see if she's got anything else. Ah, thou my hopes for thee. Ah, no, that's pretty much it. Okay, guys, I'll see you soon for some fortress. Hey, guys, back again. What's some of those level thirty? That I'll come back here and try out my new equipment and stuff here on the dragon. And I got someone here anyway, so we're going to do a free player co-op against the Goblin Dragon, uh, or nickname Vagina Dragon, as you know by night. <sighs> this should be an easy fight. Hopefully, it'll only take a minute. Since we already know what to do, and we're a lot more powerful than we were before. And now with my new sword as well. That I've upgraded. Um, that should be really nothing. We're supposed to jump in, as usual. He's on me.
vrai. Fucking, no wonder this guy is called fucking Vagina Dragon, he's such a fucking pussy. Annoying. Jesus! Seriously. Might as well so much of a riff in Final Fantasy. So he likes combustion. Yeah, you didn't like that. He's enough guys, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.